Welcome back. You're watching Quest for Quiz, the qualifying round for TVJ's Junior Schools Challenge Quiz. The scores are Greater Portmore Primary on six and Crooked River Primary on five. It's now time for the Junior Challenge Face-Off, which covers math, science, English language, and social studies. The teams have already made their selections for each face-off, so let's begin. Face-Off 1 is in the category of mathematics, and it's between Akila Bonick of Crooked River Primary up against Ashani Goldburn of Greater Portmore Primary. Akida, we begin with you. What number, when divided by 4, gives 12 and leaves a remainder of 2? Ashani, want to try? No, thank you, miss. It's 50. Akida, what percentage of 24 is 6? Time's up. Ashani, want to try? No, thank you, miss. It's 25%. Akida, what's the difference between 10 and 1.76? Question passes. Ashani, want to try? Yes, thank you, miss. 8.24. That is correct. Akita, what's the 13th number in the series? 3, 6, 9, 12. Twelve. That's incorrect. Ashani, want to try? Yes, thank you, Miss 39. 39 is correct. Akita, how long will it take a student? to read 120 pages if he reads five pages per hour? Ashani, question passes to you. Would you like to try? No, thank you. Miss. It's 24 hours or one day. Ashani, we're over to you. What number, when divided by nine, gives eight and leaves a remainder of three. Seventy-five. That's right. What percentage of thirty-six is twenty-seven? Time's up. Akita, would you like to try? No, thank you. It's 75%. Ashani, what's the difference between 9 and 1.47? 7. Time's up. Akira, would you like to try? No, thank you. Correct answer, 7.53. Ashani, what's the 14th number in the series? 5, 10, 15, 20. 70. That's correct. If 12 oranges cost $4.80, how much would you pay for 18 similar oranges? Time's up. Akita, want to try? No, thank you. It's $7.20. That takes us now to our next face-off. It's in the category of science. It's between Micah Roberts of Crooked River Primary. Micah is up against Nyla McKenzie of Greater Portmore Primary. Michael, which organ is affected by the disease conjunctivitis? It's the heart. That's incorrect. Nyla, would you like to try? Yes, please. The eye. The eyes is correct. Michael, what's the name given to the liquid rock that is found in the core of the earth? Mm. 
Magma? That's right. What's the international unit used to measure length? Meters? That's correct. What is the general name for scientists who study living things? Biologists? That's right. By what process can living things make new organisms? Reproduction. That is correct. Taking us now over to Nyla. Which organ is affected by the disease eczema? The skin. That's right. When magma escapes from the earth and is cooled, what type of rock is formed? Obsidian. That's incorrect. Michael, would you like to try? No, thank you. It's igneous rock. Nyla, what's the international unit used to measure mass? Grams. That's incorrect. Michael, want to try? No, thank you. It's kilogram. Nilo, what is the specific name for biologists who study animals? Zoologists. That's right. By what process do living things get rid of waste materials? Excretion. That is correct. Taking us now to our next face-off in the category of English language. It's between Damonia Blake of Crooked River Primary. Damonia is up against Kenya Robinson of Greater Portmore Primary. Damonia. State all the words in this sentence, which should begin with a capital letter. The students, John and Mary, live in Mexico. The, John, Mary, and Mexico. That's right. The ammonia, by adding a prefix, give the opposite of the word legitimate. Unlegitimate. That's incorrect. Kenya, would you like to try? No, thank you. It's illegitimate. Damonia, form a noun from the verb to bury, as in B-U-R-Y. Burial. That's right. Complete the proverb. As you make your bed. So you lay in it. That's incorrect. Kenya, would you like to try? Yes, be so you may lie in it. We'll double check that. That's, could you repeat? So you may lie in it. Accepted? All right, that is correct. Damonio, spell sincere. Time's up. Kenya, want to try? Yes, please. S I N C E R E. Say again. S-I-N-C-E-R-E. That is correct. Kenya, we're now over to you. State all the words in this sentence, which should begin with a capital letter. On Wednesday, the new teacher arrived from Spain. On Wednesday and Spain. That's right. By changing the prefix, give the opposite of the word interior. Exterior. That's right. Form a noun from the verb to collect. Collection. Or collector. That's correct. Complete the proverb. A wild goose never laid. Any golden eggs. That's incorrect. Damonia, want to try? No, thank you, miss. A tame egg. Can you spell transform? T-A-R-A-N-S-F-O-R-M. That's incorrect. Damonia, would you like to try? Yes, thank you, Miss. T-R-A-N-S-F-O-R-M. That is correct. Taking us now into social studies, it's between LJ Johnson of Crooked River Primary. LJ is up against Jaden Brown of Greater Portmore Primary. LJ, what's the name of the national dish of Grenada? Time's up. Jaden, want to try? No, miss. It's oil dung. LJ, in what year was the Morant Bay Rebellion in Jamaica? 1995. That's incorrect. Jaden, would you like to try? 
Yes, Miss 1865. 1865 is correct. LJ, which Jamaican national hero published a paper called The Watchman? Sure. Time's up. Jaden, would you like to try? Yes, Miss George William Garden. That's incorrect. It's Marcus Garvey. LJ, which of the Jamaica National Honours is the second highest? Time's up. Jaden, would you like to try? Yes, Miss Order of the Nation. That is correct. LJ, in which parish of Jamaica did the Spaniards first settle? Jamaica? That's incorrect. Jaden, would you like to try? Yes, Miss St. Anne. St. Anne is correct. Jaden, we're now over to you. Okay. What's the name of the national dish of St. Lucia? Time's up. LJ, want to try? No, thank you. It's green fig and salt fish. Jaden, in what year was Jamaica's capital moved from Spanish town to Kingston? 1872. That's right. Which Jamaica national hero was an attorney at law? Time's up. LJ, want to try? No, thank you. It's Norman Manley. Jaden, which of the Jamaica national honors is the third highest? Time's up. LJ, want to try? Yes, thank you. It's Order of Merit. Jaden, which town in Jamaica was known as Santiago de la Vega? Spanish town. Spanish town is correct. And that's the end of the final face-off and the end of section two. The scores are Greater Portmore Primary on 23 and Crooked River Primary on 12. Stay tuned. More Quest for Quiz returns when we get back from the show.